Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of our Let's Play of Nobunaga's Ambition as the Oda Clan. So, what is going on here? Well, we just took over the Suzuki Clan. And it looks like we still have soldiers that are making their way back, which is kind of funny. But uh, anyways, I think this year we're about to go to war with the uh, Saito Clan. That's what I think is about to happen. They are allied with two of our, I guess, sort of allies. Uh, maybe we should ally the Azai clan before we go to war so that uh, they hopefully can't bring them in. I really don't want to have to fight somebody who holds us in such high esteem, you know? And But they will probably bring in uh, the Mitsugi clan. So I'm not too too awful worried about. We just won't deploy any troops from Gujo. And if they decide they want to come down and play, well, then let them come, I suppose. Uh, okay. So to that end, let's go ahead and talk to the Azai clan. Oops, that's not what I want to do. I want to actually uh, negotiate an alliance with them. So, ooh, we could do a marriage, huh? Hmm. I don't really know that I want to do a marriage with them, simply because we probably will end up wiping them out at some point, but we can do an alliance. Uh, sure, let's do the 24 month, well, let's do the 12 month alliance. That'll be fine, I think. And we'll probably go to war as soon as uh, all of our troops are back, so maybe next month or... Possibly the month after that. Ask for anything you want. Uh, how are we on? We got more muskets than we do horses, which is kind of funny. Maybe we should buy some horses. You want. Let's buy some horses. Let's let's buy some Thank horses. That payment. way we have enough horses to uh, make sure that we have enough to go around. So, how many troops do the Saito have? About sixty-five hundred, it looks like. And have we already scouted you guys? We did. You've only got 2,500 troops. Oh, there's another one right there. We haven't scouted that one though. Well, we can, we can scout you this month. So let's scout out this castle. Nobunaga, there he is right there. Ladies and gents. Whoa. 60? Why will it take 60? Can't we can't you do it any faster? What about what about Nobunaga? Can he get it done? 60, no. Okay. Well I guess we will send her then. Maybe the further away they are, the longer it takes. I don't know. Cause I know before it was only taking like 30. So Um what are our people doing? Let's see what their orders are. Do we have anybody working on roads? Okay, we actually have two people working on roads right now. Uh, okay, so Morinari is uh, buttering up the Imperial Court. We've got some people that are moving around. And a scout. Okay. I think we were thinking about, like, moving some people around from, from Nagoya, but we might wait until after the war for that. I'm not sure. Okay, what else should we do? We have 88 trusts with the Imperial Court, so we almost have enough to request another title, which would be splendid. If you can hold more than one title, I'm not even sure if you can. So, well, I don't really, I can't really conceive of anything else that we need to do this month, so let's go to the next month. Hmm. And now that our troops have come back from the faraway land of the Suzuki, we can deal with captives. So who do we have here? Sadayu Suzuki, who is decent, good at war. Shigeharu Suchibashi, who is kind of not very good. And Morishige Suchibashi, which is, they look like father and son, basically. And they're both equally as shitty. Uh, I guess let's just employ them all. 
Okay, yeah, of course, of course. Yes, I understand. You must, you must cool your head. Okay, so the Azai clan is now our ally. Good. I like it when my retainers gain traits. So we made 10,000 gold, but we spent 34,000, mainly on horses. Ooh, a Ronin. Nice. Anything else going on in the world? Not really. Okay. Um, let's check out this Ronin. Junkoku Sutsui. He looks happy. Yeah, we'll employ him. Man, we have so, so, so many people. What about the merchant? Ooh, what do we got here? The big buffalo helmet. Grade 5. Yeah, we'll take it. We've got plenty of money. At this point. And that would be really, really nice to give to somebody who we just desperately want to keep around. So we could wait another month to see exactly how many troops the Mitsugi clan has, but I'm just not really convinced that it's necessary. I think we can just pretty much go at them. And just take them out. Or not go at them, but you know, go at the... Uh, Saito clan. Making lots of money. Lots and lots of money. Junsho. And Yume Oda. Okay. Well, we still have 48 labor left, but I don't really think I'm going to do anything with it. We're already working on roads. Um, hmm. I guess with the Hojo strengthening up over here, it might not be a bad idea to fortify some places, though. So let's fortify some posts, I think. Let's fortify this one up to three. Fortify this one up to three. And fortify this one up to three. We'll do all three of those up to three. Because that's pretty much, if the Hojo wants to come at us at this point, that's their most expedient way after they take out the Imagawa, is to just come up through Yoshida. So if we can uh, post up down there and react quickly enough, maybe we can get some fights at these posts instead of having them actually at our cities. It's probably going to take a while to get this finished, but... Yeah, about three, three months and some change. So I'll have three outposts there. Not too bad. Um... I think we just go to war here, to be honest. Uh, let's see. So how are we going to get there? We're going to have to go up and around. That's what's going to have to happen here. We're going to have to go up and around. This is their main base. 6,500 hit points. This is their secondary base. It's 4,500 hit points. So neither of these are just absolutely... Um, like, absolutely going to be super easy to roll over and take. But they won't be too bad either. So we will, of course, deploy from here, which is cool because we're going to have uh, 2,000 guns and 2,000 horses out of the 10,000 men, so let's go. very good. And then let's deploy from Shibata. No, I always do that. It's like every freaking time I do that. Let's have everybody meet up at Mino Ota. Okay. Play out of Shibata. We march to here, and then probably Inabayama, maybe Rogaki. 
Maybe both, just both. Ginta Komaki. Yeah, he's pretty decent. We march! We march! And yeah, that's we fine. march. So we had enough guns and horses basically to get the maximum amount for all of our units, which is really cool. Uh, and once everybody gets over here, or uh, once we get enough here to do what I want to do, we'll send some up this way, I think, and then probably send some around this way. I guess we could just try to take out both at the same time. That might work. We'll see. Okay, uh, let's just go to the next turn. See what kind of madness occurs here. Something strange is going on around Fujisada Nagano. This calls for swords to Nex. Really? Okay, so he's already he's already getting getting out there. He knows what's up. He knows we're coming for his head, basically. If that's all the soldiers that you're fielding, brother, um, you're you're in for a bad time. You're in for a bad time indeed. So he's probably gonna, yeah, he's gonna get up on this fort. That's what's gonna happen. Uh, we could just detour around the fort. Which I think is what we're going to do. Let's see here. Let's send you... No, I want you to go here and here. Okay, so if you hold down shift, you can designate your own path, just like CK2. Yeah, we're just going to go around the fort. There's no, uh, there's no reason not to. Okay. Leave it to me. Son of a bitch, really. Come on. Come on, game. Alright, let's just we'll just select everybody. How about that? Why are you not letting me select everybody? There we go. Okay. Everybody go here, then here, then here. Okay. The thing that I don't like here is that this isn't really disappearing. This blue. Leave it to me. There we go. Okay. Then you, then I hit uh, I hit control for the last click and it uh, set the path. So let's see what he does. I mean, why should we engage him at the fort? We can just go. Okay. So now she's gonna go up and take that fort position. Um. Well, in that case, let's just go here. I guess fine. He has less troops anyways, so we'll just engage him in the field of battle. We've gained enough trust from the Imperial Courts, so I'll stop diplomacy. I guess we have 100 now. Okay, we have a tribe with us. Oh, the guns. We have guns, sir. Okay, so he's retreating Let now. Let us begin council. Last month's finances, if you would. Of course, Nobunaga. I would love to look at our finances. Reporting in. <clears throat> I like how it changed from uh, Sadakatsu to Nobunaga now. It's interesting. Uh, Kananji can be expanded. Cool. Anything else? Zai went wary. Asakura went wary. The reason they went wary is because... Uh, we're attacking one of their allies. But we're also allied to them, so... Yeah, there you have it. I wonder if the Mitsugi clan is coming down. Yes, they are. There they are. They're sending a detachment of 1,200, it looks like. Anything else? No. Okay. Well, that's fine. They'll come up, but they'll get destroyed. Alright. Let's look at the, uh, what can we do here with the Imperial Court? Request a post. Okay, so I think these are higher than the ones that we, uh, higher than the one that we already have. I think. Maybe not. Maybe we were the Sakuma Prefect. Let's look. Is it 
say. Satsuma Prefect, explanation, upper 8th class. Okay, so that's an 8th class position. The ones that we were looking at now are 7th class, so they're higher rank. So it is worth, uh, is worth doing. Lower 7th class, I see. So what are the, all of them are just more trust gained from diplomacy. So we just basically pick the one that we think sounds the coolest. Hmm. Well, Imperial Supervisor. That sounds cool. Give me that. Give me that. Give me that rank. All right, so how many troops do they have in their other posts up here? Oh, not very many at all. They don't really have hardly anything. So they are not really a threat. I mean, I didn't really feel like they were going to be a threat, but it's always good to do your due diligence. Oh, this place is just getting pretty pretty hard to do anything with. And so is this one. Yeah, I mean, crops, I guess, is still worth doing, but... Barely, barely. I think if it was lower than 40 increase, I probably wouldn't mess with it. So this is the one that we can expand now, is uh, Kananji. But I don't think it's necessary just yet. We've still got a lot of uh, things that we can do with what we have right now. Okay. Very well. Um, so what's this telling us to do here? Yeah, just, I don't. I don't care really. Maybe we should work up the Azai clan again now, since they're, we had to, sp I don't know, it's going to gradually tick up anyways because of our Imperial post, so maybe it's not that big of a deal. Alright, so I think we just go back to the war here. So we engaged him, he's already retreating, in fact they're both retreating, they're probably both going to retreat back to Iwamura Castle. These guys are coming up. I don't really know what they're going to do. I figure they're probably just going to try to uh, come come on our backside and uh, try to uh, take us out. But actually, no, they're holding position at that fort, so they're not even going to engage. They're just uh, protecting their own interests. The messengers come from Hojo Clan. Oh, boy. Stop your aggression against Saito clan immediately. If you do not, you will face us. Interesting. Interesting. So they are basically saying that if we don't uh, stop with that, um, that uh, we're going to have to deal with them. The thing is, is uh, I can see through this so clearly. You, uh, you're just wanting us to stop so we don't grow stronger than you. I refuse. If you want to come at us, you can. Woo! We so he's apparently finishing off the... Uh, finishing we off the Imagawa, isn't he? This. Mountain roads. Gotta love them. I think let's go ahead and take these two units. Let's send them this direction. Yeah, that way we're not just, seriously, we're not just sitting around waiting for four units to go up the same path. Looks like our messenger has reached Imperial Courts. I would love to grant your wish, but perhaps with a gift of 6,000 gold. Yeah, sure. We are now the Imperial Supervisor. Let's move out! Well, he's bringing up some more units, isn't he? 
Who's this? Ah, you. Yeah, you are hostile to us. He might just be coming down to protect his interests, though. We'll see. You know, if they start winging in a whole bunch more troops, all we'll do is... Um, we'll just bring forward more troops ourselves. Let us help! Okay, very good. He is ready to serve. Well, we'll check out his loyalty. Last month's finances, if you would. Reporting in. Anything interesting? The Sakawa clan attacked Ogo Castle. Okay. All right. Well, I think we're gonna put a cut in there, and in the next video, we're gonna try to wrap up this war, but. Uh, if these guys intend on actually getting involved, that could drag the war out a little bit. And I'm uh, pretty intrigued with what's going on down here with the uh, Hojo clan and Imagawa. I'm assuming that what's going to end up happening here is the uh, Hojo clan's pretty much just going to take, take over the Imagawa. And uh, that's going to be interesting because there's definitely going to be some tension there. It's going to be like a mad, gra or a mad dash basically to grab all these little ones in here. Which, uh, the Takeda clan being allied to the Hojo is uh, really bad for us. Because it's just like this this whole, this whole block here is just nasty lousy for us. We probably should try to, uh, to get in good with the Nagao here. Probably. And, uh... I don't know, we might even need to look at coalitioning against the Hojo because they are pretty big. We're pretty big too, but they're, they're, you know, they've got a lot of smaller places back here and then you can see where they have their power concentrated. They have a ton of power here at Odawara Castle. So, I don't know. We haven't done anything with coalitions yet. It might be interesting just to check out and see. How are our supplies? 60 days? Yeah, that's, that's pretty rough. That's the rough part, is that we're kind of like really far away from from a resupply. What we should probably consider doing is making a new castle over here. Like right here, that would be a great place for a castle. Or right here would even be a good place for a castle. That way you have this choke point right here that you could fortress. Yeah, we might, uh, might look at doing that in the next video. So, Anyways, thank you guys so much for joining me, and I'll see you in the next video. Game on.